Hey guys, this is Adam from Shield and Sword Academy, and this is my little buddy Zane. You want to wave, say hi? Wave, say hi. Hi. <laughs> uh, hey guys, I was reading on the internet a couple days ago, someone that I know and trust uh, said he had his solid paste frog lube, uh, it was out in the elements, or he was out in the elements, freeze up, and it was not usable. So it was so hard, he could not use it to lubricate or clean his gun. Uh, so I figured, I want to test that, because this was in my bug out bag, uh, or to go bag, whatever you want to call them nowadays. Uh, this is important stuff. So what I did is I took four different lubricants, or actually three, sorry, three lubricants. Uh, we have frog lube liquid, frog lube paste, EWL slip 2000, and fire clean. Uh, fire clean and frog lube being probably the two most prominent ones right now that I can think of. Um, I don't have any breakthrough, and that's the big thing in the market now. The newest thing is breakthrough. I don't have any of that yet. Uh, but anyways, what we're gonna do, is we're gonna put these into a backpack to simulate them being in, let's say, a go bag or a bug out bag. And we're going to put them outside. It's about 8.30 right now, my time. We're gonna leave them out there for an hour and a half. So at 10 o'clock, I'll go out, check them, and see how all of them are doing. Uh, the other thing I'm going to do is Possibly, it looks like leave them out overnight and get them in the morning. These, uh, right now outside, it is uh, between five degrees and 15 degrees. Um, last I checked, it was about 10 degrees out, and wind chill put it, wind chill put it even lower than that. So we're gonna put these in a bag, to simulate them being in a bug out bag, go bag, whatever, um, and you're out in the woods or out in the uh, elements, and we're gonna see if any of these freeze up and become useless. Um, now remember, the frog glue paste and frog glue liquid are in essence the same thing. They're just a liquid and a paste. Um, but I want to see the difference to see if maybe the liquid is what I should be storing 24-7. Or if the liquid freezes up, maybe you need to move on to fire clean and that's it. Or to slip 2000. So we're going to put these outside. Doors right here behind my little guy here. You guys might be able to see all the snow. I'll take a... Uh, I'll like show you guys so it's really coming down out there as you can see there's the bag right there in the snow and uh, to be a little fair we'll just set up like this uh, next to here get a little more on the weather all right so we're gonna leave it out there like I said right now it is about 8 30 you see it's super dark out we'll leave it out there until about 10 do our first check at 10 o'clock and then, of course, after that, maybe wait until the morning and see what happens to all of them after they've been on the elements for 10 hours, uh, a little over 10 hours. All right, guys, check back soon. All right, guys, this is your Shield and Sword Academy. Uh, it is now 10 p.m. I'm going to go outside, uh, get the bag, and see if any of the uh, lubricants have frozen or if they... Um, just see what happens. Uh, right now it is about 14 degrees out, 13 degrees out. Um, I did take screenshots of my phone um, of what the temperature is in the area both at, uh, I think it was 8.43 when I remember doing it the first time. And I said right now at 10 p.m. So let's take a look real quick. Alright, you can definitely see it's been out in the weather. And remember, this is only an hour and a half. We're going to do one tomorrow morning, uh, which will be about, it'll be about outside almost 10 hours. Let's see what happens then also. All right, so at least the fire clean, you can definitely hear it's very loud. Uh, the liquid frog lube is still very mushy. Uh, and the EWL Slip 2000, very liquidy. See about the paste. Yeah, that paste is, uh, you can still see some is getting out of there, but it is, it is very hard. Um, it is definitely solidified. And you can actually see, maybe get a close up here. So you can actually see in there. Let me see if I can get the zoom in. To focus, I mean. I don't know if you guys can see it or not. There is a ring, you see that crack? That's where it is super hard on the outside. The inside's still a little bit mushy. 
And you see it's actually cracking right around. It's just a complete circle all the way around. You can see a little bit like a fault line, I guess it what it looks like. So again, just to give you guys an idea. Uh, so that's the paste. Uh, you guys can hear that hopefully the uh, fire clean sloshing around. Uh, slip sloshing around and the frog loop paste I mean, you can see I, mean, I can easily push all over this thing and it's not solid at all all right so next thing we are going to do is to put um, all of this back in the bag and leave it out there till tomorrow morning uh, when I get up to leave which is about 6 30 uh, and we'll test it around 6 30. All right, fair guys, I'll show you guys when I package all this stuff up that I am putting it back in the bag and back outside. All right, it's all, everything's back in the bag. And put you guys back up over here. Tomorrow, um, I'm up around 6 o'clock, probably back down around here about 6.30. So about 6.30 in the morning, I will take that stuff, bring it inside, see what happens to all of it. Alright guys, see you around 6.30 in the morning. Alright guys, uh, Adam with Shield and Sword Academy again. Hey, it is around 6.30 in the morning. Uh, I'm going to grab the bag with the uh, lubricants in it real quick, and let's see what happens. Uh, as you can see, we had a ton of snow last night, and it is pretty freaking cold out. Uh, the bag is like a bruise. Alright. So, here are our contestants. Frog lube uh, liquid, still pretty mushy. Uh, the fire clean is still liquidy, but you can definitely hear it's it's not as good as it was before. And the EWL is still liquid. The frog lube is completely solid, just about. I mean, it's. I mean, there's a little bit coming off, but it's mostly solid. So, real quick, I'm gonna move you guys over here. We're gonna do something real quick. Alright. Here's what we're gonna do. So, frog lube, uh, solid. I mean, it is, it is pretty, gosh darn solid. I still think it's it's usable if you heat it up, but I mean it's definitely solid. Uh, frog glue paste. Oh, maybe not. Uh, the stuff in the cap got frozen, which is expected, I guess. Kind of trying not to squeeze it all on the table here. So there you go, frog lube liquid, still okay. Get some here from hand. All right, so that's what froze up is right there. Uh, I think. Oh yeah, napkin. I can probably just push. Yeah, it's right there. It's mostly just coming out. Yep. So. That's still okay. Fire clean. Yep, came right out. EWL. Came right on out. So, 
as my one friend did say and did warn, um, oops, sorry, Farm and Paste had a hard time with the weather, uh, which uh, I don't know, I mean, it has to be expected. Uh, but the liquid, um, here, liquid did just fine. EWL did just fine. Fire Clean did just fine. So, uh, take it for what you want. Uh, we'll try to get a bottle of Breakthrough. Uh, that's the new hot thing on the market. We'll try it with that. Uh, if you guys have any other questions, uh, let me know. And remember to uh, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Uh, at 1,000 subscribers, we're doing a big giveaway. We're going to have holsters, ammo, uh, magazines, uh, muzzle, a brand new muzzle brake for an AR-15. Uh, all kinds of stuff. Uh, so again, remember to sign, uh, subscribe to the YouTube channel. Check us out on Facebook. Uh, it's just Google, uh, or sorry, just search on Facebook, Shield and Sword Academy. And uh, on Instagram, uh, it is uh, Adam underscore S-A-S-A. -S -A. All right, guys, thanks.